We did about three different types of experiments here for organic production. One we grew under black plastic and a planting of a crop of crimson clover and oats in the pathways, mainly crimson clover. We didn't find that we had enough coverage from that in order to keep the weeds down. So weeds came up, we did get a harvest out of it, but um, the weeds made it difficult to believe in your harvest. You had to really get in there and almost stumble over the squash in order to find them. Uh, the second way we tried an inadequate amount of a cover crop and we tried to plant earlier and within a few weeks the weeds overcame the uh, spaghetti squash that we planted without black plastic and we lost the plants. So we ended up just mowing that. Then the third one was this field and we waited long enough for the oats to get to a point where they were actually seeding out and having viable seed. And this was fairly late into the season before we got that amount of biomass from it. We ended up mowing them down, taking a look at this, and there were several options to it. So one of them that was proposed was to till it, but we wanted to really experiment and see if it was possible to grow in this section without tilling, assessing that there was not enough organic matter here from the crop that we had just grown, like we had with the spaghetti squash. We didn't want that to happen again. So we went and borrowed from ourselves some of the hay that we had produced on the farm that hadn't been used in the last year or two. We rolled out these round bales of hay and made a nicer, thicker mat uh, for planting. And then we just came and hand planted with a hoe, pulled back the soil, dropped in the pumpkin seed and moved down the line. And this one is the one that makes us feel pretty happy because what you saw in this field when it was lush and growing and green was a field of pumpkins. And now we've got the crop.